Hey, what's going on YouTube? Tomas so A here with five things that you guys probably don't know about the iPhone and iPod Touch 3.0 software. Now, first of all, control scrubbing. Now, what this basically is is that before when you were searching through a song, as you can see, I have Black Eyed Peas playing right now. And if I were to search a song before the 3.0 software, it would just be dull and very primitive. But now you're actually able to control the scrubbing. Let me just zoom in so I can show you guys. Now, when you hold on the ball, on the length ball, you you, you can hold it, and of course you can move it side to side to go where, where you want. But you're now actually able to control the scrubbing by moving your finger down. See, half speed scrubbing right now, half speed and quarter speed scrubbing and ultimately well lastly fine scrubbing so fine scrubbing you scrub through very 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 slow one second at a time um, so yeah this is a pretty neat feature about on the 3.0 software um, it's, it, but even now it's very useful some people might not find use for it but mm, you'll find use for it Okay, so the second feature I'm gonna show you guys is copy the bubbles in the text messages in the text message um app. So okay, let me just write down a text. I'm going to write do not write back. I'm making a video. send sending and I went through now let's say I want to copy that bubble that I just wrote all you have to do is hold it copy click there in the bar again click it again and then paste should come up paste send And sending. So this, of course, is very useful. You will use this eventually. You might not have used it before, but you will use this. Um, I don't know how many people know about this, but hey, number two. Okay, so number three, iTunes U. Now, if you go into the iTunes app, go into the iTunes app. Let me get out of here. Uh, so yeah, if you go into the iTunes app, you should you see songs, videos, podcasts, search, and if you could have got more, there's now iTunes U, which is va which is basically college um lectures, and, you know, you for universities or just knowledge. So if you wanna learn while you're jogging or whatever, go into iTunes U and hear live. Well, not live because it's recorded, but listen to college lectures. They have computing, project learning, nonprofit, sign talks, you name it, they have it. It's college, poets, poetry, I love poetry. Okay, so that was number three. Or was that number four? That was number three. So number four, curse words. Yes, curse words. Before iTunes used to um, try to correct curses because they thought that we were all child. Everybody that has an iPhone is a child and does not know how to curse or should not curse but now we are able to write whatever we want so if you're a little kid please look away please so now if I write if I were to write whoops fuck I told when I would not try to correct me mother fudger iTunes will not try to correct me so yeah, harsh words, but I'm just trying to let you know. I think I've written enough. Um, before the 3.0, if you write a curse word, iTunes would try to fix it. Hmm, fix it? Hmm. Sounds kind of weird, right? And now they actually implement an LOL. So if I were to write LOL, um, they wouldn't, you know, they would just leave it how it is instead of trying to make up some other word. Um, if you listen, and number, f okay, so number five, um, back to text. Now, this is something that you guys might have not known, 
But if you were to write a whole bunch of things in the um on the text app, it will only limit you about uh, I believe it's four lines. But in this one, they pretty much they, they you can pretty much go all the way. Well, almost all the way. So let me just hit return so I can show you how big. There you go. You can actually go the whole way. Um, this used to be a big deal because you'd have you'd have to scroll up or down to read what you have written, but now you don't have to because iTunes is a beast. I love iTunes. So there you go, YouTube. There was five things you probably might not know about the three point zero software. Some of you might have known. Um, if you didn't know one of them, let me know in the comment. If you don't, then let me know. Then tell me that you didn't know, or be like, "Oh, it was cool." There you go, YouTube. This will take my eight with a quick video on five things that you probably did not know about the 3.0 software. I know it was sort of a sort of a noob thing to do, but hey, some of you might not might not have known these things. So there you go, YouTube. Take my eight out.